Hi guys and welcome to today's tutorial. In today's tutorial we're going to focus on uh, earthquakes and we're going to look at the distribution of earthquakes throughout the world. Okay, so we're going to look at the distribution of earthquakes and the first thing to know is that over 99% of earthquakes uh, take place along plate boundaries. So along plate boundaries. The next thing to know is that earthquakes are found along constructive plate boundaries. So you find earthquakes along constructive plate boundaries. And an example of this would be along the Mid Atlantic Ridge. Um, now, because the plates are pulling apart, they tend to be very moderate in the intensity and they don't tend to cause too much uh, destruction. The third place that you can find uh, earthquakes is along conservative plate boundaries. So conservative plate boundaries. An example would be the San Andreas Fault in California and West uh, USA, um, where the Pacific and North American plate um, are in are sliding past each other and so you've got what's known as the San Andreas Fault. An example of an earthquake would be San a big earthquake would be in San Francisco earthquake in nineteen oh six. They do have lots of earthquakes, um lots of smaller earthquakes like like most years. Um, but that was a big earthquake that happened, so the San Francisco earthquake in nineteen oh six. The fourth uh, place that you find uh, earthquakes is that destructive plate boundaries. So you find lots of earthquakes at destructive plate boundaries. Um, and this is when the Eurasian and African plate boundaries are in contact with each other. Um, an example of this would be like Italy and Turkey. Uh, one of the most recent earthquakes they could use was um, the earthquake that happened on the 24th of August 2016. And it measured 6.2 on the Richter scale and it happened in central Italy. The fifth place that you can find earthquakes is at volcanic eruptions. So you can find volcanic uh, uh, earthquakes at volcanic eruptions. Um, an example of this would be at Hawaii. So Hawaii suffers lots of uh, volcanic eruptions each year. And sometimes it can create um, a build up pressure. And this pressure when, when released can create like an earthquake. The sixth place that you can find earthquakes is actually um, in the middle of plates, so the interior of plates. Um, and this isn't along plate boundary, so it's actually in the in the middle of uh, the of the the plate. An example of this would be um, an earthquake that happened in July in nineteen eighty four, and it affected the east of Ireland. And it was actually measured 5.5 on the Richter scale. Okay, so I've just jotted down a few examples for each one um, to go along with the, the distribution of earthquakes. So you've got an example for each one. And you can use these examples. And if you'd like to take them down, you can just pause the video now. So that's it for today's tutorial on the distribution of earthquakes. Uh, if you enjoyed it, can you please leave me some feedback and follow us on Twitter, Facebook and Instagram at Exam Vision for You. And remember to check out all our other videos on our website at examinevision.ie. Thanks guys.